I started to face a lot of anxiety and depression in college. Um, it was really tough because I felt like I had everything that I should be happy about, but yet like I just like was having panic attacks and a really hard time wondering like where I was in life. A lot of times I would feel like a little bit like unclean from the things that I was doing, just like drinking and things like that, that just didn't really signify like who I felt like I was. I remember describing it as feeling very trapped. I moved here and I dabbled in a few jobs from here and there and then I got um, what I thought was my dream job. Um, well, it turned out it wasn't exactly uh, the right fit for me. It was a very intense environment, um, a lot of pressure on someone who already has a hard time. I started to make myself sick. I was like getting panic attacks, migraines. Um, I was crying multiple times a day. I was just, again, found myself in a dark place that I was hoping that I wouldn't ever have to be in again. From that, I think it was an incredible blessing actually looking back on it now because that was a thousand percent the driving force and to what um, pushed me into my faith. God takes us through really hard times in order to realize the really good times and what you need for yourself. Now at the time being in that period I couldn't see that but looking back it was like if I never would have gone through that I wouldn't know who he is like I do now. I had a friend who was here for um, the summer and she had told me about C3 and so I was like I need something in my life that is you know greater than what I'm feeling right now something I can latch on to and um, just you know get myself out of this dark hole and feeling very alone so I um, went to C3 and it was immediately an incredible experience I felt like I had found what I was missing and what I was looking for. And even though I was still in a very hard period, I was still in the job, um, I knew that God is good and he's with me and there is a reason for this. And if I just put my faith and my trust in him, he's going to come through. Right at that period was the daughter's conference. So it fell at an incredible time. Literally, I had quit. I was struggling, just like grasping. Um, now what do I do? What does my life look like? <laughs> uh, what's the next step for me? Um, I was a little nervous about what the experience would bring. I was, I had friends in the C3 community, but I was just like, what is this going to be like? So I decided to go anyway, because I was like, this is a God thing. It's falling at like the perfect time, so I have to go. And I did, and it was literally a life transforming weekend for me. Um, I had an incredible experience happen while I was there. Um, I was prophesized over actually and it just like I don't know it was crazy because I everything was just aligning and it was just so obvious to me that this is God like there's no other way that this can be anything but that definitely a turning point to be able to be like wow there's a room full of girls here who believe what I believe and that have the power to um, you know transform other women's life and men as well um, so I think that that was a huge thing for me is just the confidence to be able to speak up and to you know tell other people that God is good like I want you to come to the conference with me this year because I want you to experience what I got to experience. Just transform my life, honestly. Like, um, since then, I view everything differently. God's always at the center of my thinking and any decision I make. It's what, you know, what would God want? I'm praying to Him. I'm asking, like, what is my next step? And I think I tried to go through so much of my life, like, choosing my own steps um, instead of putting my trust in Him and my faith in Him and knowing that He will um, kind of guide the way and show me my next step.